What's up, everyone? Today there's an Echo uh, PB580T. It's a pretty decent little machine. I wonder if it says it runs. But as soon as you put the throttle on, it just kind of bogs. I do not try it yet. Just want to look at the fuel. Looks to be a little on the older end, but not bad. So I'm thinking carburetor, obviously. There could be a blockage in the in the exhaust, but I guess we could try the carb first. Let's see here. Wait a minute. The carb is loose. Well, that would definitely do it. Oh, there's another one. This could be as simple as a world's massive vacuum leak. Filter's not horrible, but it's not great. Oh yeah, it's not even on. Oh, look at that. How can we just wants to just bolt those down? Let's see if it runs. Well, at least it's not jiggly now. Um, is that primer blob in it? Yes, it does. Primer seems to be working fine. That's this is choke. That's off choke. Um, considering it's a blower and it's a little dusty in here, I'm gonna put the cover back on, and we will see about turning it on. Well, now that we did that, um, let's just take a look. Uh, we have a cold start. I did pull it over just to make sure, but I never actually tried to start it. I just wanted to make sure it had decent compression, and it does. Is there a switch? Yes, there was. Makes sense. Can't just leave it running all the time. short video. Um, I definitely think it needs to be tuned up. The idle's a little low. Let's do that. Let's see. Uh, it's one of those. Okay. So, here, in fact, let's just get you a little closer. So in here, it's obviously the idle, and that's the low, and there's a high. You have to have a single D 
There we go. Adjustment screwdriver to get it done. It's kind of hard to find that good one of these. Like they sell a lot of them on the internet, but they're really kind of bad. Um, I was able to actually get one that was pretty nasty, and I just ended up like fixing it myself. So I think it's a little rich on the low. So let's just. Rich is going to make it smoke like we saw. It's also going to make it bog, bog down. Well, not bog, but it might be too rich and could kill it at a little idle. Um, too lean can make it run too fast, too, and cause damage. Just a little, a little rich. Let's tighten it up a little bit. Um, I'll probably look at the plug, clean it at the very least. And that's about it. The fuel lines, nice and pliable. I mean, it's dirty, don't get me wrong. But this would be an easy one. If you're having issues, check to see if your carburetor is fully seated. This is a textbook definition of a vacuum leak. Vacuum leaks on idle, you probably could get it running. It's going to be a real dog to start though. But yeah, this should be about it. Well, this is simple, kind of stupid, but it worked. So if, you, if it helped you, let me know. Definitely put a thumbs up. Definitely subscribe. I'll keep on posting. Have a good night. Let's catch you later.